today's spot, we're going to be checking out another box from the folks over at Gamer Block. This is Gamer Block rated E for everyone for March 2017. If you are interested in gamer themed items, including t shirts, collectibles, and more, you can click the link down below and subscribe today. Now, not only is there the Gamer Block E for everyone, but there's also the rated M for mature as well. So if you want something a little bit more mature, Yes, I know I said mature. You can subscribe as well to the rated M for mature. But in this case, we're going to be looking at the E for everyone. I'm going to get this opened up and I'll show you the contents inside. After that, if you like what you see, by all means, click the link and subscribe today. E for everyone, M for mature. It's entirely up to you. Nonetheless, though, this came with wrap. I've already taken the wrap off. I don't want to sound like a broken record, but I take the wrap completely off. So if anybody feels like, geez, this seemed pretty easy to get into and get to the contents, don't worry. There's wrap that's generally on these. I just took the wrap off. So let's find out what we got inside from the rated E for everyone gamer block. The first thing we're going to look at is a t-shirt. The t-shirt inside. Oh, I like this one. First of all, I love gray t-shirts, but this is a gray t-shirt that features a Pac-Man ghost and a boo. And they're both reading spooky stories. And the spooky story, in this case, has a Pac-Man and Mario represented on the cover and back. Really like that. I love ghosts too. I love uh, boo. Boo's one of my favorite non-Mario characters from the Mario universe. It's a nice looking schnazzy t-shirt. Also looks really good on the gray. Uh, we've also got inside a pin, which is a vacuum cleaner. It says your darkest fears, which obviously I guess is a nod to probably Luigi's Mansion. On the back there, we've got Gamer Block E for everyone pin, zinc alloy and enamel pin. Pin illustrated by illustration by Ashley Hay, and there's also a website there if you want to check out Ashley Hay's work. Very nice pin. And included as well, Five Nights at Freddy's Socks. You know how I feel when it comes to socks. I loves me some socks. It's rather interesting, the older that you get, the more things such as socks make you happy. When you're younger, you're like, ah, I don't care about socks. But when you're older, getting socks for gifts, that's not a bad thing. It really isn't. And we have Freddy Socks. Uh, to be exact, it's Crew Tube Socks from BioWorld, Five Nights at Freddy. This is size 10 to 13, so that will luckily fit me. I keep kind of avoiding this. I shouldn't be. I, I mean, let's, you know what, let's get to that right away. I'm curious as to what this is. This is a uh, Hype IFX virtual reality headset, a 3D experience in your hands, compatible with all smartphone devices. Uh, it's 360 photos, videos, play VR games, watch 3D movies. I'm curious as to actually, I don't have my phone with me right now. I should have, you think I would have been prepared for that. Not to think that I would actually have gotten a virtual reality headset. But let's open this up because I am curious to how virtual, how good is this? Because I've seen our cardboard ones out there as well. This looks like this is plastic. I'll open this up. There we go. There we go. And you've got your headset inside. Oh, it's actually... It's rather, it's much more impressive than I thought it was going to be. Got 3D VR uh, glasses, Hype IFX. And I guess you just, is there a hinge on this? Oh, there's a hinge on it. So this opens this way. From suction cups, you put your phone on there. There's sections on the side that you can, oh, sections on the top too. You can access all the controls on your phone. Then this sits onto the back portion. Your eyes would essentially go right there, and then this would just wrap itself around your head. Yeah, I guess for what it is, you know, it being plastic and all, not bad. Not not bad at all. I'll put that over to the side. I almost, I almost dropped it. Included as well, we have a Super Mario multi-tool. Uh, it's a key ring. It has a bottle opener and screwdriver. I think I had gotten one of these before and it was a Legend of Zelda. But this one's an old 8-bit Super Mario. Screwdriver, screwdriver, bottle opener. There's the back of it right there. Perfect for uh, carrying around with you because it's nice, small, and compact. Yet, it does have all the functions that you would need from a portable multi-tool. And of course, it does come. It does come from the folks over at Paladone. www.paladone.com. Oh, 
we've also got ourselves the game box. And this is a uh, Stearden. I think that's how you pronounce it, Stearden. Back right there, Stearden is a, a frenetic and chaotic space shooter carved in big, beautiful pixels with insane boss battles. Embark in your ship and engage the fight against dreadful space pirates in a never-ending combat for your survival. The game is fast, addictive, hard, and action-packed. With all these awards, it's also won Best Shooter uh, Shoot'em Up for 2015. Well, you know how I normally do this on this channel. I give this to one lucky viewer. And always somebody says, oh, I didn't get to it in time. Well, unfortunately, that's the downside of it. There's only one coupon or one code here uh, for a viewer. So here is the front. Everybody right now is dashing to get a piece of paper. Mom, was there a piece of paper? Mom, piece of paper, piece of paper, piece of paper. She's like, what, what's going on? I got to get a code. Piece of paper, piece of paper, piece of paper. Of course, you need a pen, too. It would suck if you had paper in front of you and you didn't have a pen. Ready? Here you go. Here's the, co here's the code. You can launch the Steam client software and log into your Steam account. Click the games menu. Choose activate a product on Steam and then follow the instructions by using this code. It's the least I could do. You know, I always try to do my best to offer these guys to you. You take the time to watch these videos. I certainly don't mind taking the time to share the game codes with you. As well, inside, we've got the Nerd Block Magazine for March 2017, the Gamer E edition. They have an exclusive Q&A with the creators of Stearden. What's inside the March Gamer Block? And five reasons you should be watching Ash vs. the Evil Dead. We have some unboxers here. No, you will not find me, sadly, here. No, unfortunately, I'm not there just yet. I mean, I guess we could start some sort of, I don't know, revolution. Start a revolution to see me in as one of these Nerd Block Nation uh, unboxers. A goal granted, you don't see my hands. Oh, you only see my hands, you don't see my face. So, yeah. I guess, I guess it would be helpful if I showed my face and had me unboxing these on camera. That's probably one of the reasons why you won't unfortunately see me here. The five reasons why you should be watching Ash vs. the Evil Dead. Uh, lots of cheese, for example. Plenty of gore, which I guess is the main draw to the show. Uh, a great cast, Terrifying Monsters, and of course Bruce Campbell. Kind of wish they had done another Evil Dead movie instead in lieu of uh, a, a series, because you, you can only do so much with the series before the character kind of gets watered down. I wish they had done more of an Evil Dead movie, but that's just my opinion. Uh, Q&A with Damien and Matthew, the creators of Stearden. What's inside the gamer block? Let's find out. Virtual reality glasses. We got Five Nights at Freddy's Sacks, a Super Mario multi-tool, the Ghost Vacuum 5000 pin, the Stearden game, of course, and Ghostly High Score t-shirt. Flipping through further, can you spot all the differences? I'll just kind of hold that there if you guys would like to try to guess, guess for yourself. And then there's a section for a Q&A with uh, Johan Akio, the creator of Lucius. Uh, if you like Exo Man of War. And lastly, an advertisement not only for the horror block, but also all the multitude of different boxes that Nerd Block are producing as well. New year, new boxes, all coming in 2017. Sorry, what? It's 2017 now? It is. You're correct. It's 2017 right now. As well, on the back, there's an advertisement for Valor Blocks, the only monthly subscription box filled or loaded i should say fully loaded with u.s army merch subscribe once get it every single month www.valorblocks.com that's the place you can go to and you can subscribe and get valor blocks maybe we'll actually do a couple of those on this channel as well in the meantime today we were having a look at the uh, gamer block this is gamer block to be exact the e edition Rated E for Everyone edition, and that was for March 2017. If you haven't already subscribed to this pan this channel, what are you doing? How come? What's what's the dealio? You can click the subscribe button down below and always be aware of new videos as they're coming up on this channel. Also, check out my playlists. There's tons of other videos on there as well. Sometimes you think I haven't done a video. I might have. It's in there. It's in the playlist. As always, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.